The first phase of the Ukrainian counter-offensive began. The first phase of the Ukrainian counter-offensive has already begun. At this stage, frontline reconnaissance is involved, which enters the Russian rear to a depth of 30 kilometers. This was stated by military expert Roman Svitan. He noted that the active operations of the Ukrainian army intelligence began immediately after Easter, when greenery began to actively bloom in the south. Scouts operate in the Russian rear, collecting information needed to plan offensive operations and strike at key targets of the occupiers. Directly in the Kherson region, army intelligence could indeed land on the left bank of the Dnieper, as previously reported. This landing could be a preparation for the creation of a bridgehead before the counter-offensive itself, Svitan believes. The expert emphasizes that the bridgehead will not necessarily be exactly where the activity of Ukrainian intelligence is now noticed. The final decision will be made later, and the scouts themselves enter the occupied territory wherever they can enter and complete a combat mission. Along the entire front line, from the Kinburn Spit to the Kupiansk, everywhere our scouts operate at a depth of up to 30 kilometers, Svitan explained. The expert emphasizes that this cannot yet be considered proper offensive actions. They will no longer be concentrated along the entire front line, but in one or two directions. According to Suvitan, the armed forces of Ukraine have the strongest positions for the offensive in the kherson zaporozhye direction, where the Russians are already pressed to the sea and have only one supply line. But the Donetsk direction is not beneficial for us, Svitan explained. 